If you still consider yourself a beginner in AI and are wondering how to use it in the real world, this is going to be a perfect video for you. As what I'm going to show you in this tutorial is how you can repurpose one piece of long form content into dozens of variations of short form content, whether it's a YouTube video or a podcast episode, how you can repurpose that with AI in a matter of seconds into a blog post, social media posts, email newsletters, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So be sure to stick around to the very end. Now, if you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Ryan. I appreciate you being here as my goal is to help you navigate the overwhelming world of artificial intelligence. And yes, it is extremely overwhelming, which is why I'm making these AI for beginner videos just like this one. Now, if you have any thoughts on this topic, be sure to let me know in the comments below. But now let's dive back in on how you can repurpose long form content to short form content with AI in a matter of seconds. So in this tutorial, first I'm gonna be doing a more basic example of how you can repurpose content, and then I'm gonna show you a more advanced example using a custom GPT. Now, I am also gonna be using chat GPT as that's what most AI beginners are still using. I'm on the plus version. If you're not on the plus version, I'd recommend upgrading to that. But you can also use Claude to do this as well. So chat GPT and Claude, I wouldn't venture off those two AI tools. So what I'm going to do in this example is I'm going to use someone's YouTube channel, right? I was just on this guy's podcast and I live in Des Moines. So I'm going to use him as an example. Let's say you're a small business who does YouTube or you're one of, you're a realtor like Darston is here and you do YouTube content. What you could do is repurpose this YouTube content into blog posts, social media posts, email newsletters, et cetera. And I'm going to show you how you can do that with a simple prompt. So let's say, for example, I have the prompt right here. I'm going to copy and paste this prompt come back to ChatGPT, and I, by the way, I'll leave all these prompts that I mentioned in the video description below so you guys can easily access this. And what I said is I need you to be an expert in content creation, marketing, and repurposing content. If I provide the target keyword and transcript for a YouTube video, can you repurpose that video into an SEO optimized blog post? Actually, I'm gonna change this video into the following. I'm gonna say 1000 word, SEO optimized blog posts, three social media posts, a concise yet helpful email for my weekly newsletter. So we're gonna start there. And now it's gonna ask me for the target keyword in video transcription. So in this example, uh, let's just look at his most popular one. Uh, let's say pros and cons of living in Des Moines. That's a good one. So what I'm going to do is click this, Thanks for pause it so it doesn't play. And so for the keyword, it would be pros and cons of living in Des Moines. So I'm gonna come back to ChatGPT and say target keyword copy and paste the keyword. And then I'm going to say uh, transcript. And then I'm gonna come back to the video, click more, scroll down and find the transcript here where it says show transcript. And I'm gonna copy and paste the entire YouTube transcript. This might take a little bit, it's a 40 minute video. And I'm gonna come down here, copy this, come back to ChatGPT, paste that transcript and click enter. And what it's going to do from this long transcript, literally in a matter of seconds, is craft this SEO optimized blog post based on the target keyword of pros and cons living in Des Moines. It gave you a title, an introduction, it gave you the blog post here based on that YouTube transcript. Uh, and then what it's going to do right here is give me social media posts. Now again, this is not going to be a silver bullet. This won't be perfect. I'm gonna show you a more advanced uh, example here soon on how you can get a better SEO optimized blog post from a YouTube transcript. But anyways, as I digress, you can scroll down and it gave me social media posts. Text, it gave you the text, the graphic idea, gave you a Twitter post, Twitter post two, email newsletter, is Des Moines, Iowa the right move for you? Hi there. Are you considering moving to Des Moines, Iowa? And it gave me an email newsletter, social media posts, and a blog post based on this one YouTube transcription. So that is a very basic example that I just showed you in a matter of seconds is how you can use one long form piece of content, AKA a YouTube video, and then use AI to remix and repurpose that into different variations of short form content. So now let's do a little more advanced example for repurposing long form to short form content. As you'll see here, I created my own custom GPT called Video to Blog Post Converter. I'll leave this in the description below if you guys wanna try this. I've actually spent uh, quite a few hours fine tuning this, uh, giving it all these different instructions of how I want my blog post to sound, give it outputs, uh, uploaded images, uploaded some other things, did some other configurations. 
Basically, I've spent a lot of time fine tuning this. And what I wanna do is I wanna click this conversation starter right here. Repurpose my video transcript to a blog post. I'll provide a target keyword, yada, yada, yada. So what I wanna do is come to my YouTube channel and let's say in this example, I wanna repurpose this video, five real world use cases for Notebook LM. So I'm gonna click that video. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come down, click show transcript, and I'm gonna copy and paste the transcript of this video. Now the target keyword for this video, if I can paste copy the transcript here, the target keyword here would be probably real world use cases for Notebook LM or probably just use cases for Notebook LM. So that's what I'm gonna do. Come back to ChatGPT. I'm gonna do target keyword. Let's do use cases for Notebook LM. Then I'm gonna give it the transcript. If I can spell anything right here, paste the transcript and then I'm going to click enter. And then what this is going to do is you'll see right away how much more advanced this blog post looks compared to what I showed you in the previous example. So it says use cases for Notebook LM, how to maximize its potential, gave me a meta description, SEO title, introduction, key takeaways. I even have it, you know, have a place where I can insert my YouTube video embed. I, I put that in the settings, uh, real world use cases. Notice how this is, uh, you know, in the formatting of H2s and H3s, right? That's an H2, these are H3s. Uh, how to get started. Notice how I have links here where I instructed it to add links into the blog post, uh, FAQs, conclusion, et cetera, et cetera. So I basically fine tune this custom GPT to get me a high quality SEO optimized blog post based on the target keyword and the video transcript that I provide. And again, I can also take this same blog post and say, uh, great, now repurpose this blog post into uh, LinkedIn posts, don't, or let's say use a maximum of 300 characters, provide three examples of posts and don't use emojis or hashtags. But you guys see where I'm going with this, right? You can keep going on and on and on and repurposing whatever you had before. So now it says, LinkedIn posts, right? Google's LM, yada, 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 uh, post one, post two. So again, this isn't perfect. You'd obviously have to come in and polish a lot of these, but that's it. I mean, that's a more advanced example using a custom GPT on how you can repurpose a long form YouTube video or a podcast episode into short form content variation, just like I did with this SEO optimized blog post. And again, if you guys wanna access this custom GPT, you can definitely do that. I'll have this in the video description below. Now also something that's a little more advanced when it comes to repurposing content is using a tool like Opus Clip to repurpose long form videos into short form clips. I'm not gonna get into this. I have a whole separate tutorial on how to use Opus Clip, but I have a podcast, right? And so every podcast episode that's 30 minutes long, I'll use Opus Clip where it AI generates these short clips, optimizing it for mobile, adding engaging subtitles and captions, and then I can auto schedule this on short form platforms like YouTube Shorts, TikTok, Instagram Reels. And if you notice, some of these have 400, 500 views. This one had almost 2000 views, right? It's not a silver bullet. It's not gonna go viral or anything like that, but these are thousands of views that I would have never had had I just kept on posting the long form variations of my podcast. That's why repurposing long form to short form and using AI to help you do that is such an advanced strategy and can help you gain more eyeballs on other platforms. So that's it guys, I hope this video helped you out. If you do consider yourself a beginner in AI on how you can repurpose long form content into short form content with the help of AI in a matter of seconds. So again, if you found this video valuable, be sure to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, leave me a comment below if you have any questions or just thoughts on repurposing content with AI. But most importantly guys, I hope you all have a great day.